PSNY12, a 320. Oh, Fred Yeezy, Snake Good Jesus. From uh, Orange, Virginia. Pure Monies. I'm looking for a fresh pair of films today. I'm looking for Laker 6. I'm from it's DC. It's birthday today. Yeah, it is. I follow you guys on YouTube. Hey, I'm late. What's up, dude? Bike? Yeah, bike, but I left my wallet at home, so I had to turn away halfway. <laughs> Hit the dip move, you know. Freaking guys are in China. Big moves, it's so sick. And then next month, NYC, East Coast Boys, I'm gonna have to go up there for the grand opening, if I can. You would, if you could believe, it's hard to get off the schedule for a day in here, but. It's old Elder Colson out there spreading the word of Christ. He said, <laughs> I was walking in and he goes, it's kind of like the Bible. I don't know much about Mormon people, so if we have any Mormon followers, like, comment, and subscribe. We got premium. We got Paisley Box logo, freaking 850. We got freaking CDG 280, Gore Tex 750. We got some backpacks, a couple decks. We rarely have decks, so it's pretty cool to get some like rare, actually rare ones. The uh, anniversary, the kids, and I forget that artist's name. Don't don't kill me, Supreme Supreme lovers. Who is this man? And have you seen him? It's a nice biking shirt. He has 15,000 followers. Yo, <laughs> he has more than like everyone in this room combined. So. Is this the is this the Supreme line? Is this is this the Supreme line? No. Oh. oh. Face banks. Loose change face banks. This is uh, clothing brand. Also, Rice Kim's gonna be here too. From San Diego, Champion jerseys or maybe some vintage hats. I thought this whole line was for here too, but for loose exchange. But I guess we were the first ones too. I'm just chilling here around two, waiting to get a bait mask. Um, honestly, this is my first time. My friend told me about it, so I just came to check it out. Sell this kind of stuff. Um, try to help get some Yeezys or something like that. Full case. Uh, babe, uh, let's sell some Yeezys, some Jordans. Good morning. <laughs> another day, another photo, right? <laughs> Jackie. Guys, if you're lined up for this pop-up, can you move to this side of the street so it's not there's a walkway and people can get through? Come on. Okay. Not really sure what happened what outside. But, huh? Well, Grow up, Levi. I would also, what is that line outside? Like? Um, it's the line for the shop. Is it actually? That's yeah, not we the... dropped box logos. That's not, it's not for the pen away. Nah, it's for box logos. They're called bogos in the business. No, I don't know. I think Rice Gum and like all, all these YouTubers and like banks, all them have like a pop up shop around the corner. Yeah, there's like 100,000 people. I almost plowed down a group of people trying to get in the alley today because they wouldn't move. But I didn't have my cow catcher installed. I'm getting it tomorrow. I'm going to Platinum to get it. So fucking, we have everyone from New York out here. We're gonna, we just want to give them like real life in store experience of like just how the store works. Just try to like show as much as you can. The fine details of shit that I'm crazy about. You know what I mean? Dealing with people, just like how we fix things, like how we get the shoes, how we bring it out. Just like the whole like function of just like how the store works and stuff like that. I think everyone should go around and say two things about themselves. Yo! Yo, yeah! Yo, circle up! Yo, Luke, love it, love it. All right, I'm gonna start the brick with Manny. All right, well, my name's Manny. I hate like wet napkins. The texture of it kind of creeps me out. My name's Daniel. I don't really like pickles. Hi, my name's Franklin, and I hate rats. My name is Steven and I travel the world going to Yu-Gi-Oh tournaments. Yo, I'm Stellan, and I don't like telling funny things about myself. I'm Theo, fuck 12, free take i I'm Tyler, and I love Jack. <laughs> I'm Jack, and I hate Tyler. I'm Jenny, and I love everything sci-fi. I'm so and I love me. <laughs> I'm Juwan, and I love everything. Oh, this is gonna be good. Uh -oh. David my, doesn't know much, he's my, No, 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 my name's David, and I like the Kelly Cafe. <laughs> David wants three quesadillas, yo! <laughs> I forget that we haven't flown for so long that I've missed you. Season four. <laughs> but yeah, we're back. We're better than ever about Open New York. We got more people, we got more family, more friends. Like, I'm never too, too desperate at the flea, but sometimes we are really low on vintage. This time we were super low on vintage in here, and we're leaving for China tomorrow. So I've been like really stressed out. Like, got there today and I got a lot of stuff though, so I'm pretty hyped. Half zip, pull over, the ties, the pocket, later 90s. The New York squad in here. Meets LA squad in here. It's gonna be a crazy day. I'm ready. I'm ready. I need the right jacks. Morning. Here I caught the starter Lakers jacket. My dad actually caught the Supreme uh, Yankees hat. 
Yankees fan for sure, for sure. But from San Diego. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and then we're still looking at uh, the vintage round two, so we're gonna pick some stuff up there. Uh, future snake aces. My man came up. Free mash tray action here. Out here early this morning. Worthy cop. Uh, speakers in the box logo. Uh, just resale. All of these are for resale. Miami Dolphins jacket for my son. Looking for a bathing ape, but we got this. We're good. I don't got the Lake of Sixes, but you know, I'm a big fan of Sixes and Fours. So I think I'm going to go with these ones right here. It's an hour and a half drive for us, so we try to come up here as much as we can. Yeah, we come up here for the race, NASCAR races and stuff like that. <laughs> but yeah, that's usually about round two NASCAR. It's very, very redneckish. The only reason why we go there is to drink and hang out with friends, so that's what we usually do. We fall asleep during the race, so that part doesn't even matter. Fresh AF. I love fives, they're my favorites. If they had some great fives stay in my size, I definitely would've got them. I picked up the white on white Arabic from Japan only for $350. That's fucking, that's a steal, man. So I'm really happy to add this to the collection. The vintage Gus, 1989. I always, I like the old ones, but you know, this is pretty good for now. It's how Rocky did good with these. Follow me on YouTube at Henry Mouse. Yeah. Sneaker vlogs. It's like vlogs going around you and stuff. Great store. The guest, the guest stuff here is really cool. I feel like the style these days bring back vintage stuff. Or this one. <laughs> the original plan was to get that uh, the Pink Panther one, but it got sold yesterday, three hours after it went on sale. Rush did all this work just for the shoes to have already been sold two minutes after the shoe, after the, the curtains open and they were gone. <laughs> yeah, been about three years too. Business school, yeah, brand new. Yeah, I'm doing. I'm back. <laughs> so the dude just came by to our uh, 12 wall and just rearranged everything. Pick up a shoe, replace it, move it, pick up another one, switch them around, put a hat way up here. I don't know how, but he did it. So right Damn, here's the, here's yo. the layers, right? So it's just gonna be so fire. So, but I gotta do it like, you know, I gotta do it this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Damn. Okay, okay. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I'm gonna put the tracing people yeah. up with a um, spray mount, and then I'll cut this out with a razor, Sick. and I'll spray it in, and then I'm gonna stencil the fat caps. Fuck. You know, yes. so you get that like boom. I love the fat caps on there, dude. That was like Thank you. when I I'm, when I was talking about that was like the there. dream, yo. Because I was like, and then Air Max. made yeah, these myself. Just kidding. Steve Cab made these. You know that? He used to cut his shoes. So then he put these out and like cut them and like duct tape and all, and all that shit. It's kind of cool. Oh, what is this you didn't ask me? Just a bunch of box logos we're getting ready for tomorrow. Yeah, a couple of many. Many, many box logos. <laughs> this actually is um, a, a, a holdover from, uh, from the New York pop-up. But it's one of our favorites. Yeah, why don't you around to your Yeah, we should do a rip. Uh, New York should say. When you leave New York, you ain't going nowhere. Fucking right. How sick is that? Like 1970s, yeah, early no, that's 80s? Fucking I thought it was It's cool. true, though. It's true. Yeah. I'm gonna just tell you. I know this to be true. This is another one of my favorites. The Kevin Lyons. Air You Breathe. 360, come on. Dude, this is what inspired my scene. He had a jacket, too, didn't he? Wasn't there a jacket? Didn't he have something he did, else with this? I know he did a t-shirt. I had the t-shirt. Jacket, I'm not sure. Look at this. I shouldn't be more than an hour, hour and a half. Your time, we'll be here all day. Yeah, so will I. All day. I'm fucking hyped. See you, See you guys in a bit. Alright, yeah. we'll be here. Thank you. Yo, what up? How you doing? Hey, Mom. Hey, guys. Oh, thank you, sir. The, uh, the New York was fun. The Empire. Stash? I probably first heard about him in like 2004 or five when I was like on Nike Talk trying to like get hip to shit. Like Sean said, a crazy dream come true. It was like a huge honor to have him do this for us. Uh, a month now. I got kicked out, you know. Los fired me. Los is rich as dead. He got too big, got cocky. He didn't need a media manager or anything, whatever I was doing. Publicist. Versus like, yeah, Los's dick got huge, like out of nowhere. Los got all engorged fucking talking about it. Oh, shit. <laughs> Uh, these are New York ones. Oh yeah, I'll give the I'll give the explanation, the sex explanation. Uh -oh. <laughs> so a couple of visits ago when I came to New York, my little brother Jack came with my dad and my little brother Finn to visit, and then Jack like wrote me this letter when I got back to California, and he was just, you know a little letter about coming, and in the letter he said like New York was fun, so 
Ash actually had the idea. She was like, oh, you should take that and make it into a shirt. So I just like, you know, took his exact handwriting, traced it, made it into a shirt, says New York was fun. And then that was how he said from Jack on the letter. So I thought it was cool for like New York shirts for like our opening day. Just hand this over to me and get the fuck out. Is there another compartment? Bro, this shit's so sick with the little fucking yeah. iPad and you get both. Hit, hit you with that slow pull up in, you know what I mean? I couldn't, I couldn't get off. Had to get it. Today's a good day, Bait. Shout out to my mom. Came through. He was like, round two's right next to it. Had to come. Killed two birds with one stone. <laughs> Dude, you can't even see it. This man saved up. my life. Hey, this is my man. My man, all right? I love him right there. <laughs> I'm down for vintage day, man. Check it out. I've been thrifting since maybe I was 15, actually. Uh, you meet the best people, <laughs> you experience the weirdest and the best things, and um, I find, like, I found a polo sportsman jacket with bullets in it. At the flea market, there was actually a bin found and there was a gun in it, and it was returned to the LA Police Department. <laughs> It's a 1985 Judas Priest. This is sick. Dope. So I think right now I'll grab these. Okay. Um, is there anything you had specific pricing no. in mind on? Um, Shout it out. I beat 100 on the Judas Priest. Mm -hmm. Like 50 on the Chanel. Like 60 on the Malcolm X. Like 40 on the Apollo 13. Um, 40 as well on the Fleece. Like 80 on the Gucci. 370 cash or 4 credit. Thanks. He passed on my Howard the Duck uh, 80s bomber silk, but hey, he did pick up the 1980s Judas Priest, which I found for like $1.99, right to the heart. <laughs> some people some people can be afraid to come here, you know, but I always tell them, just, just go in there, ask questions, start talking to people. It's that community vibe, you know? Cleveland, Ohio. I'm uh, actually Hi. driving down. We made a four hour detour to come here. Hell yeah. And get our piles sturdy, good foundation, and then we can begin. Old day. I think there should be a few winners in here. Going through vintage vibes is always fun. Really never know like what type of stuff you'll see. Like this guy, for example. Vintage ACG, nice color blocking, good condition. Got a vintage jersey. Pretty tight. Obeezy. Wonder what the resale on the Trump tees is gonna be in 10 years. This is pretty cool. Team Adidas USA, big fat sleeve patch, and white tags would be 80s. How about that? Old big head Joe Montana tee, Screen Stars tag. And Keith Haring, pride in all sizes, shapes, and colors. Be proud no matter what you look like or who you are. Just live for Jesus. Just do it. And let's see what sneakers he has. Some Presto, some Patch Air Max. These are the cool guys. Damn, that's up. Atmos Club, if you weren't hip. Yeah, the materials in these are sick. Let's hope he's not taxing on these guys. We're looking at about 170 for these guys, and then around five for these. I gotta see what he's thinking, so we'll try and work it out. I'll we'll call him over in a minute. So I'll go thrifting up in the like Cleveland area, and then some of the stuff I pulled off of eBay, most of that stuff besides the sneakers is all thrift stuff. Yeah, honestly, I kind of brought them in to hopefully maybe get something I'd wear, because I'm almost too scared to wear them, and it's not, it's not really my style anymore. It's just fun, man, it's like a, Kind of like a scavenger hunt, almost treasure hunt. Every time you walk past, you can go through a bunch of piles of crap and then all of a sudden come across something worth you know, 30, 40 bucks that you get for 50 cents. I mean, why not do it? Just these for these, straight up. Straight trade for the Atmos. And then we quoted him at 320 cash for his vintage and his other shoes. Um, so he's gonna walk out of here with 280 cash and this guy's crew neck. Here's your, your new looks. Right, thank you, I appreciate it. I got your cash for you as well. Boom. And what was your name, man? Travis. Travis? Awesome. Yeah, dude. Travis. About to show Ash and Nash round to New York for the first time. Very excited. Nash's first time traveling. <laughs> Say hi.
Looks like I'm a little tired. It feels just like, like around here, right? Yeah. I feel almost like I'm in LA. Yeah, we definitely have the aesthetic. Sure. So check this out. Behind the counter space and then... Let's flip over here. Whoa. Send this. We'll be the this gallery. This is crazy. Yeah. So check this out. So you can look the build out right there. We can pull up that? The wood. Success. Oh my gosh. Yeah, this is amazing. This is like our gallery for the New York store. It looks so good. Yo, Graham. Our first gift for round two, New oh, York yes, City. Cool. The good homie fridge. The crazy, insane hand cut wood gift. So sick. Just dropped it off the day before we open. Introduce yourself, man. Like, Jesus. What up, round two? Just want to drop off a present to the homies. Say, welcome to New York City. We made it an apple. It was because of New York and also because you guys are definitely going to eat out here. <laughs> so, that's why it's bitten out of the shit. The Yo, this it. is insane. Like you know how Cody be embroidering? Yeah. And that's exa like like that. Dude, crazy. what? Yeah. So where, what's good? Yeah, where's the centerpiece going? Put it, up, put it up, put it up, put it up, put it up. Put up the new sign. I like it. Yeah. That was a mistake. Dude, huge mistake. Yeah, you're good. We have no colors. You good, Beto? You know. Damn, that. That fits Literally fits perfect. That's so sick. Wow. Hey, I like this little cutie. Oh, it's cute. Where's your sunrise? Yeah, this is my girlfriend, Ashley, by the way. This is, this is Nash. Nice to meet you. Nash, I'm Nash. Hey, buddy. <laughs> He's like, I'm just chewing on my thing. <laughs> it's so crazy. Oh, it's going good. A little. <laughs> seems like it'll work. <laughs> Can he get up yet? Yeah. Big steps. Big steps. I know. <laughs> this is this is what we call hit it and hope. We just don't know how it's gonna react. I don't know. Kids are, kids are crazy. Oh, uh, it's a YouTuber, Logan Paul. No, big YouTuber. Everybody's going crazy over this year. Going. I got some goodies for you guys. Yeah. Hey, at first I thought that line was for heroes, like good lord. I rolled up this morning, I thought like, the same thing, fuck, and I was dude. like, dude, my day is over. Yo, so that's like a combination of like three different stores lines out there. Yeah. Yo, so you looking for cash or credit today? Um, cash. Uh, not much, man. I just came down from Arizona, you know, trying to get this money real quick for the Supreme. And oh, let's see, I brought a, what was it, a Field Parka, Supreme Field Parka from 2013, I believe, the red camo. They took uh, the five metallics that just came out like a couple years ago. You know, my car just recently got stolen and I had to get a new one. So, like, I came down here to get this bread real quick to put towards that. So, I got these hats too, but I'm, this one just came out. I don't know what you guys will offer for that. I got Slayer. Um, this is the ballerina tee that came out. Yeah, I love that. Yeah. The cover, I yeah. Love this. this was a very good tee. So, so I think I'd pass on these right here. Um, on this stuff, I'm at 850 cash or like 950 credit if you want. 50 cash. cash. All right, what were you doing for the, the park? Though? I was at 225 on that one. This like we would pay more in the winter, honestly, but it's just out of season for us. I feel you. Yeah, that. yeah. Like we'd pay closer to three if it was like dead ass winter, you know. All right, let's yeah. do that 850. There you are, sir. Kind of gave me more than what I expected. I brought like a bunch of shit trying to get like what I needed and they, they hooked me up pretty good. Yeah, so I'm happy, you know? I know. The messed up part is I'll probably be back to buy all that shit back. <laughs> you already know. Here we gotta get a hot one. <laughs> Got a nice bag full of shit. Yes, yeah, sir. Sure. You gonna like one of them. I wonder what's in here. <laughs> Woo! And then you gonna like the scene in threes. Woo! Classic MJ shoe right here. Nice Carmine six. The fives, the tens. The double nickels. Trivia, who knows why they're called double nickels? I'll wait. That's, that's the shoe he had on and when he came back wearing the four or five. And also, uh, I think it has something to do with Madison Square Garden. 
I think there's one thing missing from it. I think it has to do with the amount of points he scored. Double nickels, so he scored whatever two nickels adds up to. I knew it was something of that nature. <laughs> he scored 55 points, two nickels. All right, so we grab the Carmine's Fire Red 5s and then the Fire Red 4s. Uh, for 160 cash or two store credit. Just some old stuff that was sitting around, pretty much that I don't need it in Just, just like, kind of getting it away. <laughs> Thank you, my guys right here, man. Oh, yeah, likewise. Yes, sir. That's the right one. <laughs> there it is! <laughs> man, ever since they first opened, these guys, great attitudes, you know, great customer service and great deals too, man. I love it. Legend. Craziness. There's a lot of wood coming in. Pause. Round two, waiting for it to open for tomorrow. And of course, Yankees have to win. Here, hoping to score that Kermit and 2K Monster. I don't even know. I heard they open tomorrow, like around 11 a.m. overnight. It's just it get hectic, crazy. It's not like the regular. LA stores, New York is a different story. You just have to be hard body. They shut down Brooklyn Supreme two days in a row. Hell yeah, Brooklyn was crazy. I mean, as long as we get organized, the line, wristbands and stuff like that, it will be more organized. But if I don't, I think it's gonna be a long day. <laughs> it's like they dry super matte, super good, and really top shelf. But you know that, round two, only top shelf. Uh, mutual friends, I think, really kind of put us Together, weirdly enough, I know, it turns out I know Sean's uncle. We used to live on the same block in Brooklyn. I think Instagram might have just really made the easy way of communicating where we just saw what each other were doing and just reached out. This particular thing, celebrating round two in New York, I, I'm gonna infuse like a little fat cat pattern. It's kind of what I'm known for, a little nozzle treatment that I put on Nikes and a bunch of gear back in the day, and this appears in my artwork, so I'm gonna sort of layer it I'm kind of doing it backwards today because it's on glass, so. Good afternoon, everyone. Hi, Graham. How are you? What's up? We have some guests arriving. One of them sucks. His name is Luke. And Yo, I just, be, I just be flicking people off from the front now. <laughs> Hello. That was what I was talking about. Oh, my God. Now that'll get white in no, behind so there, and then I'll have the other blue around it. Damn. You know, a little pit eye. No, this shit's unreal. <laughs> <laughs> that means. No, now I'm gonna put blue from the back to the front. So. Yo, that was so fucking sick. <laughs> That's crazy. All right, it worked, all right? We went back to front. Now we're out front looking at the back. Whatever that means. Crazy uh, how that works. It is fire. Out, all right, round two in New York. Yeah. What's up, Tatum? Hey, how are you? Trying to sell something? Let's see what you got. These are all in big sizes, though. So. Spring. These are gently warm. It's just yeah. tight. Emotional, though? So you just kind of kind of, mm -hmm. got to feed it in there. Okay. So I would take the Tommy today. It'd be a little tougher sell for us, yeah. given it's a puffy jacket. And I would take the two hats. Would you look for cash credit today? 
silver? Probably credit. Uh, credit. 100 cash or 120 silver credit. Okay. Do you want to look around uh, for a little bit? Think yeah, about I'll it? Look around for a Just bit. let me know. It's a nice Tommy puffy jacket with the sweetest color of the lock known to man. Tight. All embroidered on the back. The crest. Cool. So it's 40 for the Tommy. Just a little tougher sell for us. Even in Richmond, it does snow. And then 30 a piece on the hats. Um, side, we're from Cherokee, North Carolina. Just follow the YouTube and uh, love watching it. Um, big shoe guy though, so I was definitely checking out the shoes here. Yeah, these are awesome in my size. Good price on them. Too. I actually never had a pair of uh, ones before, so pretty excited. Thanks, appreciate, I appreciate you. It. I only had to pay 10 bucks, so that's happy. My wife will be happy. And I get a sick pair of Jordan, so I'm happy. <laughs> wow. wow. Dude, it's yeah. What'd you do, Phil? Leave it here. You know, I'll After do, like four or five months, finally. Holy shit. Here, Yo, shout out to round two from France, Paris. Round two in French? Tour deux. Tour deux. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> Round two, baby, New York. It's lit. 628, got about, what, 14 hours? 15 hours? <laughs> it's, nah, tonight's gonna be a hassle. Tonight's gonna be a very big hassle, bro. A lot of people coming out tonight. The animals is coming out tonight. It's New York City. The zoo is gonna happen. <laughs> Yo, you guys gotta get, you guys gotta stand. Yeah. Sorry, you can't sit right now. Oh, <laughs> Welcome, round two, New York City, opening day. We're out here, Mr. Wotherspoon. Hey, oh, hey. hey, Graham, hi. Got a whole new thing going on out here. Whole new vibe, East Coast vibe. Well, it's not an old, it's an old new vibe. We've had that vibe going in Richmond. Um, for the people behind the camera, Graham looks like Jacques Cousteau. He has a beanie and like a denim shirt on. Just want to give people a preface of what's happening in my life. Uh, we're also opening the store today, uh, the New York store. It's very important to me and my business partners and New York as a whole and everyone who loves us and supports us. So thank y'all for that. Can't believe this is happening. Like Stash is doing our window. It's just like uh, a culmination of like my lifelong dreams as a cognizant adult kind of coming true and it's very uh, very humbled and very excited. It's pretty sick. It was down Stanton, down Essex, and it's heavy down Essex. It was long, stressful, tired. It was very cold, uh, like 4 a.m. to like that. Best 14 hours of my life right now. 16! Can't wait to see 14 from, bro? Bro, I lost track. You fell asleep three times. What the fuck I'm talking about? <laughs> hey, we bringing this shit back to Jersey, you know, that's how we do it. We apple picking, we fishing. We fishing for the goodies out here. We're dropping off a painting. Boys, welcome to New York, yo. Been out here for 16 hours. It's gonna be so easy to sell all this stuff. Wait for the random steals. Fox logos, maybe some uh, New York uh, round two merch. Round two New York City, I'm from Jersey. Bro, I skipped school today. Shout out Dope Closet Thrift. Hit him in the DM, he couldn't make it. Shout out New Jersey. 12, 12 hours. hours. Yeah. Connecticut. We, we came here deep as hell. Last yeah. night, camped out like, like 1 o'clock. Yeah. yeah, took the 10, uh, 10 o'clock train. So. Round two, welcome. Finally, finally made it to New York. It's about time. About to make some cops, about to make some drops. I'm very excited. It's for the culture. It's for the culture. It's for the culture, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Been the one in Cali. I'm so happy it's in New York and I'm ready to go. I'm awesome. uh, guessing ASAP, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna get it now. It came just a little too late. Right, uh, Polo rugby. I'm gonna move it! Everybody relax! <laughs> Round two, man. Just welcome to New York, man. We've been um, looking for you for a while, ever since the pop up. Washington, out here. Finally waiting for this round to open up. I'm from Jersey, Jersey, man, Jersey. Yeah, drove up from NC. Love these guys, man. Been watching the show for a hot minute. Some shit that's in a 2X, some old Tommy shit, you feel me? I heard this was the spot, so you know I'm coming out. I've been waiting for this shit. Definitely, I thought Sean was gonna drop his sneakers today. I'm kinda like, you know, kinda disappointed about that, but you feel me, I'ma catch it when they come. New Jersey, shit, yuckers. I'm just trying to cash out some heat. You already know this one. I've like, seen like every episode like three, four times already. I'm trying to bring these uh, sample duck and bear fleeces. It's good, Graham. So, like, what's up with the grand opening, you know? What's up, Graham? What's up, Graham? How's it going? <laughs> trying to get some uh, OG ones, probably some shadow ones. Four years in the making. 
So glad you guys finally came here. Hey, we drove up from Pittsburgh. Just gonna sell some things, maybe look around. Yeah, I'm selling some stuff here, trying to re-up on some new polo. Corona Queens. Some old bay, Staten Island. Are you from Brazil? Just traveling and now I'm going to the store. Uh, Gettysburg, Maryland. We went to the Richmond, Virginia store. Like, yeah, I'm here to mess up a check, man. You know, yeah, I'm gonna cash up out. Check. Uh, what up, Plant Hill, Brooklyn. I came to the pop-up shop, got the hat, got the Calvin Klein round two shirt. Shout out to Jennifer. Yo, what's up? Shout out Wars to Poland. Uh, YouTube. Yeah, I've seen the YouTube show and then Instagram as well. I'm from Brooklyn and I'm just sitting here and here to see what's up. Some time sacks, hopefully. They blessed me up with it. Queens, about time you guys opened one in New York. Came from Philly, couldn't sleep, so I headed off at 5 a.m. Been here since 8. Stand, stand, stand. I'm coming from Jersey. Yo, I'm coming from Brooklyn. I got here late. The line was already long, which makes no sense. I'm North Jersey, Eric. You're coming from what's Orange? Jersey. Jersey. You just came to see what kind of clothes they got. Jersey. We've been to uh, Virginia one already, the California one, and we've been to the pop-up when the pop-up was here too. So we're just making our rounds. Long Island, it took us like two hours to get here today. All the way New Jersey. All the way New Jersey. Stanford, Connecticut. Chelsea. What's up, man? We came from all Williamsburg, Brooklyn. Williamsburg, Brooklyn. New York native. Staten Island. Yep, Staten Island. Mm -hmm. Shaolin. Hype. Waiting months for it. Yo, I'm Fabio. From the What's Bronx. going on, man? Get Retro VTG from Harrisburg, PA. Yes. Welcome neighborhood. Jersey City. Jersey City. City West Side. Keep the bad brains. Looking to cop some cream. Boy Queens, New York. Yo, oh, New York. What up, what up, what up, what up? Uh, PA. 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 Some, got some guest shirts. I'm from Connecticut. Out. Went to the Virginia store a couple times. Checking out the uh, NYC ones, y'all. Came out to see the stores. Always been supporting it for a, a while, so. Staten Island, trying to get the bread for us. The Bronx. Trying to get a little North Face. Supreme. Came from all the way from D.C., man, showing support. Yeah. So, yeah. We came just for the grand opening. Just trying to cop a BOGO. Maybe some Yeezys. I'm going to find some SBs. Going to New Jersey. We're going to find a cop of Boga. Coming from New Jersey. Free wild bait, man. Just got here. Had a wild night last night. Woke up early. We're here. Round two, baby. You already? Uh. Everybody has to take a step back and get against the wall. You guys got to get out of the sidewalk. Uh, we're here from Hasta Body. We're going to try to do something half as good as what round two does on the regular. We're at round two, NYC, opening day, where we're Sean with the spoon. Yeah, I do our social for High Beast. Uh, we're just here, like, you know, covering the space, welcoming round two to New York. It is a extremely long line out there. There's probably about 200, 225 people. Do you know I'm excited for the stash or be like, you fucking ready? You fucking ready to open? You ready to open? We're only 10 minutes late, but it's 11 ish anyway. Better needs to reveal what he's done. Damn, you fucking killed it, Sash. Round two was five. That shit looks slow. I'm standing on the rock. Hold on, but Beto, I just want to hang. What up? What up, yo? How you doing? Yankees. I'm actually taking this and the uh, Shabuya tea grand opening. I'm hype. Yeah, I'm really around two. Yes. Two fifty. I'm gonna come back. I had to go to work right now, so yeah, long day, and I got double shift. Thanks for coming in, man. BK the door god. <laughs> Fuck. Got a Kermit tea and uh, two K Moss teas. I'm seeing about maybe this thing too. CDG polka dot. Size small. Box of Kermit. Rare size. I'm trying to think of it as a good as price. It is. Yeah. 350? Yeah, we go for like five. Yeah, dude, really good assortment yeah, actually. Supreme Forces, and if I'm not mistaken. Yo, but you know you came up crazy on this pair, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, you got the back. Yeah. <laughs> I got the It was a look -see sample, yeah. yeah. Can I cop this? I don't know yet. I'm looking for more heat. Box logo. Yeah. yeah. I got me one of you guys' shirts, right? I got this jacket for myself. How to cop it because it was sold out. And these two. Like, you know you gotta get me Hello, the, the biggest round two cop out right here. Space Jam Pat, Chicago one. Nice. Yo, everybody move. It's good. Picked up these 950s. I mean, I traded my Oreos that I paid 260 for. They had a 50 bucks, so I paid 210. It's a good day. I'm gonna move these for like 550. 
basically like uh, we need to talk to community outreach and get like barriers and shit. The line is just too crazy. People walk on the sidewalks. So we're trying to like corral that and get people in. I'm trying to get more security guards out here because we only have two. We need like five or six. Man, I'm glad to see y'all out here. Round two. Welcome to New York. You know what I'm saying? It's your boy Rex Hogan, Stylish Stoner. You see it's pandemonium. We got the whole squad. Twelve done showed up. Fucking, we ain't tripping, you know what I'm saying? We just out here trying to get some clothes, trying to get some gear, trying to get some sauce. That's that kid's Supreme Patty, isn't it? Go ahead. I just got off work. I work at Payton Dolphin, 420 North Fairfax. 420 North Fairfax. You know, trying to get everything pink, you know. Shout out to my boy, always holding me Fox. down. We out here, and the New York store is opening up from New York. My little brother's is excited, everyone's excited. I was telling them everything. That light pink uh, suit, and then Yo. you had the Air Max 97s on, the pastel pink. And guess where I got it? Right here. Down. Luke styled me for day and night, let it be known. Uh, we're looking at some, some guests. Uh, nobody really liked this piece. I actually find it to be really dope. To be honest with you, maybe some vintage Nike and some bait for my girl. Man, you know, I just came in here for my birthday. Grab a little bait polo. Real steel, you did? 150, my size. Might have to buy it. Might have to buy it. Uh, everybody just can chill here. Uh, look at all the cool clothes, the shoes. It's just a dope vibe store. Like, I, I love it. I um, got I got it for $60. So like when you come here, it's like completely different. Say like atmosphere almost. You're with a ton of people who like wear the same type of clothes you love, and it's really cool. Fire. This is some heat right here. The brown, the vintage. That's some heat, yeah. That shit's sick. It's really tight. It's Maroon Sixes, you know. I wanted these for a while. Coming out to LA, he was all the way in VA. That's cool. And it. This shit smells good. Oh no, my boyfriend called me. It's always good. Oh, he's um, stationed in Texas right now, so. He can't get it. <laughs> this oversized Supreme tee that has cool ass graphics on it. You know, for the fall time. This has got the, uh, the basic uh, striped shirt. Oh. And today's his birthday, so came all the way to Richmond yeah. for his birthday. And we're back. We're filming again. Nice day out. I started working with guests recently and they brought me through their archive. Something with character, it catches your eye and it means something and I think that's why my generation is focused on vintage right now and the best way that I can you know, see these other eras and get close to living these times is through the clothing and that's why the quality means so much to me. You'll put on an original guest striped shirt, you immediately put yourself in that year and it gives me goosebumps even talking about it. It's so true and if you've ever experienced that, you know exactly what I'm talking about. I pretty much like surrounded myself in original guests and wouldn't let myself out of it until the new stuff was exactly like that. In the early 80s up to the 90s, Guess was producing a lot of their best product here in Los Angeles. It's where city meets desert, succulents, there's sand, it's sunny all day, every day. You get vibes of these earth tony colors. You get lots of browns and lots of green. It kind of all goes together, but somehow it's a city. And that's what we're gonna bring to you at Complex Con. Subversive graffiti artist Banksy, whose works are usually found adorning the streets of London and Bristol, has now created nine spray paintings on the controversial barrier which separates Israel from Palestine. Perfect. Do you have a price of mine up for anything? Just uh, three for those. Perfect. Okay, shot there. Nice. Do you have a price of mine for this guy? These two, I want to trade these two for a Nas. These two for a Nas too? Probably just have to be adding a little bit like 50 cash. Mm -hmm. I'll probably be like at 150 circuit credit and then like 70 circuit credit for that guy. Yeah. Just to try and cut you a deal. Okay, I'll think about that. I mean, and then this guy would be like at 120 circuit credit, 100 cash. And then these would be at 220 sort credit, 200 cash. Do you want to 
I'll do a, I'll do a hundred cash and I'll look around. Perfect. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. It's been good. I started my own brand. I have my own shirts it's called Crunchyroll Skate Club, and I sell it at my local skate shop. I have a website for it. and I have an Instagram for it. at Crunchyroll Skate Club. Um, so, what you want for it? Well, I was thinking like around a stack, you want to meet me in the middle, to 11. That's cool. Are you guys are we doing Yeah, I bought this uh, a long time ago. I got a couple of more. Like everything, I pretty much except right you know, original fake stuff, so I've been knowing it for a long time, you feel me? What was your name again? Wally. Wally? Yeah. So, good to see you, man. Thank you so much. Good to you whatever. All right. All right, bro, peace. Just a toy. Not a big deal. Cause toy. Hey, Graham, if you want to talk to someone who's actually interesting and wants to talk to you, then come on over here to me. Just kidding. Check these out, though. Crepe Soul. Air Max ones. <laughs> I'm hyped on them. So they have like everyone in LA, they have us all flying to China on the same flight. It's gonna be like, everyone's calling it like like a uh, streetwear summer camp. It's um this event called Intersect in China. Edison's throwing it and um, we end up getting a boot there, a bunch of other, it's like complex con in China really. But it's gonna be sick. They got us all in the same hotel. Like everyone's gonna be there, everybody. So it's gonna be China mayhem and like we're going out there Monday. And then once we get back, we open New York store. We finally uh, made it. Yeah, finally made finally it. Made it. <laughs> so I see. waited. What time I got here? Five? Yeah, a little bit before five. five. I got here at 10. I literally have to rush out an exam just to make it here. You want to show Chinese. a couple things? A little TLC. Little Eminem, you know? A little Eminem. Mm -hmm. yeah. We'll see what happens. Yeah. But You thrifted this? Two bucks. No. <laughs> what up, y'all? Yo, you <laughs> came up. What? What? He Yo. called me. I was sleeping, and he called me. I I'm like Jesus you Christ. <laughs> Why were you sleeping? Exactly. Yeah. The one day. Still call. with tags. With the tags. Reversible. I like it. I like it. Do you guys go to the bins or just the regular thrift? There's no bins in Jersey like that, really. But we try. You know, we've gone to Queens. Okay, Queens nice. is where I was there. All thrifted. Majority. Oh man, killed it. That's tight. Is that everything? Oh uh, yeah. Cool. All right, so right now I'll take this pile. I'll probably pass on these for now. Okay. What are you thinking on this? I wanted you to make an offer because I do have a high offer on eBay. But just throw it out there. I'm just curious. Uh, my highest offer right now on eBay is 350. 350? It's a good offer. Um, we would probably pay like three, you know, or like 350 store credit. Want me to tell you where Adam on these? Yeah. I'd be at another 180 right here if you wanted. No, take a look, see what's good. Want me to write you a cash ticket for these first? Yeah, cash. Right. And then just hold on to that TLC, and if you find some, just bring it back and we'll work it out. Okay. Yeah. It is. It's the fucking Rage Against the Machine like summer tour, but Wu must have played with them in one of their shows, dude, which is fucking insane. Look how big this tour is. Yeah. What the hell? Yeah. That's so sick. I got an MJ on 88. Yeah, I love these. Yo, where's Uncle Luke? <laughs> Damn, Liza Minnelli. Yeah, it's just that. I we found that in the MJ deal. I'm really trying to get into these movie and film yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like the next big category. Yeah, no, so. Alright, on these. You know what? Alright, I'm at 300 right here. Okay. Um, and then what are you thinking on this? I've gotten offers around like four, five. Um, so, I mean, anywhere around there, I'd be willing uh, to let it go, honestly. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? And I'm probably, um, honestly, going to do some store credit, yeah, yeah. too. You know, so. All right, so three. Um, I don't know. I couldn't see us paying much more than four, you know? Uh, I probably want to pay four, but. Four flat cash? Yeah. Oh, that's cool, man. Want to do that? Yeah. Cool. How much did you get this for? Man, I told you, man. <laughs> Here, I'm dying to know. I got that and a great tag Jordan for like 40 shipped. Boom! Yeah. Ships? Yeah. Someone had this yeah. listed? Yeah, yeah. Tripping. I think they had it a little bit. Yo, I appreciate Thank that, you, man. man. This piece is fucking fire. I was able to trade up, and then I was like, I was being nice, so I, uh, I sold on my TLC. But I've been, I'm leaving with this. So, uh, love a little thin line between love and hate. And a little cash, which is never terrible. You know what I mean? So, round two is for the people. <laughs> They got our vote. Yeah. Check 
is These that? These are my babies. Yo. Budweiser shoes? These are so poorly constructed, but these are sick. Look at the midsole is like cracking. Damn, dead stop. Guess jeans. Today's been a fun one so far today, Graham. We've been freaking doing buys left and right. It's about um, just before four. We've been crushing it all day. I'm high. Ooh. Isaiah. Pistons logo on the front. Damn, is another one? All right, now we got some real ones. Damn, that's sick. Yo, these are crazy bulky. Even compared to the, the V1s, how bulky they are. This is the first time I've seen them. I don't know, man. Let's go find out. Come on. It always hurts my heart a little bit. I'm going to be interested in vintage Celtics. The two 49ers jackets, the Isaiah Thomas, and then these two guest pieces. We're also looking at your Pirate Black and your OG 94 uh, Sacramentos. Okay. So that stuff, excluding the Budweiser sneakers, is at an even thousand cash, about 1050 store credit. What do you, what do you want for either of these Budweiser sneakers? You don't. You said you don't want to put too much into those. It's just a risky, risky buy for me. You know what I mean? Um, I'll do five on these, so we're at 1050. If you want to go ahead and part ways with these for 150, so it'd make everything an even 1200. I'm actually very happy with everything. I really am. Have a. Ink and sign and ready for you. My man. Thank you very much. I love y'all. I'm gonna come see you in New York. Man. So at the pop up, five kids got hit by a car. It's like crazy. Like we saw rice gum come out, and like everybody was just sprinting. To I started sprinting to him too. Vintage is popping. It's just a beautiful Saturday over here. We got the whole New York squadron out learning the ropes. Dude, World Industries, got those at Rose Bowl. Um, it's probably one of the coolest finds. Probably my most my most epic Rose Bowl find. And then right over here, we got our little favorite little baby. Perfect for upcoming month of October. Nightmare on Elm Street. Life size. It'll haunt your dreams forever. See you, man. You see this fucking teeth? It's fire. It's fire. I'm excited for New York. It's gonna be a fun crowd. Uh, we're gonna make shit happen, you know? Switzerland's far away. Perfect, actually. Treating is just right. I got this very dope pleated Tommy Hilfiger jacket. Bring me through the winter in Switzerland. <laughs> Shout out to round two. Yo, uh, I'm from, from LA, but they're He's from, from LA. UK. They're from UK. <laughs> We're from everywhere. Uh, shopping. 21st birthday. 21st. See, we knew we were coming here first, thought we wanted to go when we come here, so. You guys, go subscribe to me on YouTube at Davis Kicks. This vlog will be up tomorrow, or I'm gonna be, I went to the pop for Rice Gum and Faze Banks for Loose Change and vlogging here. And trying to sell some of the SB, yeah, at Long Beach State and studying fashion right now. Uh, the Mickey shirt. Fresh. Just fresh. And then the Matt Rise Nike shirt. Found this fire babe reincarnated tee. Never seen it before. Snoop Dogg collab. Tiffany Blue House tees. These mean a lot to me because I interned for Diamond Supply and one of my designs recently just got published for Diamond, so. That'd be sick, yeah. Complex Con's gonna be really good. I didn't go last year. I didn't go either. So yeah, we'll have a booth. I get to reveal my Air Max. We're doing the guest thing, so. Oh, you're gonna unveil the Air Max? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So like, I'll be leaking pictures leading up to it and then that day it'll be like the first day you get to like see the full shoe like in person. Yeah, I know what it is. Sandal Boys, shout out to Fran. Yeah, yeah, this is the All of a Sudden Tour. And then yesterday was actually my 10 year anniversary on YouTube, so I'm wearing my Dream Crew 10 year anniversary merch. Go cool, next order. Oh, the gallery. Yeah. yeah, so this is the one I already have. Yeah. So you have the. This is like pretty much everything we have. Pretty much? Okay. So, so you got the black And then we have some of the ready to wear as well. Oh, you got the baseball. He plays for the Angels. Okay, sick. Yeah, so um, game tonight at 7. Damn. Is it um, where you're on uniform day? Uh, the jersey, the sweatshirt. And the backpack. This place has been here for a while. I don't know if you filmed it before. It's called the gallery. It's like where we, it's like our collection of private shopping stuff. Thumbnail? <laughs> <laughs> These are crazy. Those are the best ones though, because Travis wore them, right? <laughs> <laughs> he wears them. He wears place. them like every day. So pretty much like what I'm trying to do right now, this has a little bit of cracking. I was in love with it because I like the two-tone, but they have this black one and it's like, it's a lot easier to rock because black. 
easier to wear with like than brown. So I'm, I'm gonna try this one on, and I may do a swap if Luke's down for it. So. Cool. The homie Easy designed these with Jordan brand for Travis Scott's new label, Cactus Jack. But this one, Easy came by yesterday and hooked me up. Right when I saw the first picture leak, I hit up Easy and I was like, dude, everything about these fucking shoes is perfect. Oh man, I'm already, I'm gonna miss grand opening. I'm gonna be there the second day. I'm about to pull up to see what's going on in New York. Everyone in New York, be ready. Round two's coming. Picked up these vintage Yankees tea. It's pretty dope. It's only 40 bucks. I got this little, this little fabric right here, a little cushion right here. It's pretty dope. You know what I'm saying double XL is pretty hard size to find in a baby tee, so pretty excited about what I got. Fire Supreme jacket. New York was fun. Congrats on the opening, by the way. Had to. Good price too. Really good price. Yo, thank you so much. Oh, this, no is, this is his uh, dome size, man. This is like some of our favorite stuff. Like his mom's got the shirt. I've got the shirt, the hat. So bad golf sake. Got the CP92, you know. US Citizen Polo, you know. From Staten Island. Got a shop out there, so got to represent the world. We're here in New York, round two. It's here at Mr. Stash on the wall, Mr. Goldberg in the building. Warren Fox logo here. And a pair of Miami uh, Nick A6. You know what I'm saying? We in here, round two, New York. Like I just told them, they saved me a lot of space and time for having to fly across the continent and I can just get all my sauce in one spot. Babe. 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 Right? I right yeah, I got a couple guest shirts and a babe sweater. And I'm probably picking up this learn. I don't know, man. Winter is coming, so you gotta be ready. Got the Nas Escobar. Escobar season. Feel me? Gucci. Jamaica Queen, Southside. Black cement. I got some guests and I got some Stone Island. The OG logo. It's a blessing. Round two, New York City. Um, last time I saw all of you guys was in Paris at your pop up, and that was cool. And this time I brought my dog Louie. And I live down the block, so I'm sure I'll always be around visiting you guys. That time of the year, man. Had to cash out. <laughs> I got the Costco Madonna tee. Uh, baby blue box logo t-shirt. Pretty hyped on that. Cashed out, bro. I got the humans. 600 bucks flat for the size nine and a half. Super clean, bro. OG all. Look at that. I had a streetwear as part of my life, you know. Growing up in New York, all around. The mecca of the culture. Dude, fucking Richmond, Virginia, up in this bitch doing it big. Yo, shout out Bo Field, shout out the mayor, shout out my boy Tony Rowe out in LA. You know what it do, you know what I'm saying? Guys, you got the vape in here, got a vape hoodie, better cop this. You know. Did you get in, pick up a jacket? Okay. I went with a vape hoodie. Just a little Supreme soccer jersey. Size large, 350, bling box logo. Hell yeah, dude. Got my vape calls hoodie. We already know, Flex Coop, Grrr. South Jamaica, Queen South Jamaica, we out here. Man. Yeah, we've been a fan of the show. A little bit of cream, vintage babe, a little more. I'm guessing y'all can see what my favorite color is. Can't go wrong with some of these. Had to get this shit, this shit is stupid fire, this fun, cream fucking more. And of course, the vintage Tommy, you gotta go with it. Right here with the flags, the sailing gear, dope. I fuck with his neon green right here in the back. What's going on, man? We live from Jersey, man. Came through the show, let around two vintage, man. It's probably gonna be a staple of New York City vintage culture, uh, fashion culture. So, you know, we had to come through first on the first day. And I got, I got some other jewels in the car. I might probably bring through. New York welcomes Nelson. You know what I'm saying? That's that real throwback stuff right there. Yeah. Just some breads for my girl, and looking to get this Gucci. Of course, some New York tea. Got two of these. One for me. One for my boy. Good to know that we've been to all of them. <laughs> and we'll be back again. <laughs> Some OG guests with the crazy all over print. And the, the polo rugby. It's a long time coming. Finally scooped up some DB3s. 450, size 13. Welcome to New York. You know what I'm saying? Showing love around too. Waited in that long ass line. Met some dope ass people on the line though. Okay. Best part. I even met a person's dad out there waiting on line. This cool ass dad. Season four? I gotta get on season four. You know I'll be watching. <laughs> Goldies, dead stock. For my son. We just got this vintage OJT and uh, this vintage Tommy jacket. Got a fight of the century, OJ Simpson trial tee. Uh, at 100, traded up for it, only paid 40. My little cousin, a birthday gift, you know. 
Turning 13 is a big year. I got me a Supreme flask. <sighs> oh yeah, this, this play is more a little special something something. <laughs> 240. Yeah, somebody hit me up for these. I wanted them myself, but somebody hit me up, so I came running and grabbing real quick. This dude is in Houston, Texas. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> had, to, had to come through. Get the condo Simmons, you know. Yeah, just doing some shopping, homecoming coming up, BSU. <laughs> NMG tri colors, 130. It's a pretty good deal. The infrared sixes, super good price. Came through on the way to a soccer tournament, actually, so. in Myrtle Beach. Sean, size eight and a half, Air Max. I need that. I want two pair, but I ain't gonna be greedy. Air Wilder Spoons, what's up? I need two. You know, I need one to rock, one to stock, but I already know. And I need that autograph. That box needs to be autographed. Need to be autographed. You like Tinker right now. Thank you. We got the Utmo shirt. Pizzeria in the back, ladies. And look at this thing. I just don't know anyone else like who has this or like who's gonna have this. The blunt man. All right, YouTube is John and Joey, right? Well, we do crazy yeah. stuff, man. Go check us out. Yeah, Seriously. go check us out for real. Can I do the backflip real quick? Gotta, gotta support the NYC store coming out. The little premium action in there. Oh, 100%. I love it. The atmosphere, all the all the people here, it's just it's so fun. You no run up. You ran up. You ran up. Yeah, just, yeah. Step. just step, yo. No step. No step. Just straight up and. Boom. Hey. All right, all right. We got more jeans. Oh, he's over. Oh. Ah. And I was a run up. I got, I got tight pants on. I got tight pants on. Like athletic shoes. You have athletic shoes. You have basketball shoes. Bring some stuff to trade in. Looking for cash or credit? Uh, store credit. I'm actually gonna try to trade up and get that red, the two X Tennessee. Oh really? Yeah, dude. That's why I brought the large. It came from Raleigh. Yeah, it came from Raleigh too. Damn. So you're you're going for the big guy, huh? Yeah, the big guy. I flew, I flew up here actually this morning, yeah. yeah Flying back tonight. I the uh, grand opening yesterday. So I come back for DC. I want to say the dude never wore this too. Really? He wasn't even a 2XL. I wouldn't fucking be surprised. Yeah. I've never seen a 2X one before. Exactly. It was crazy. When he pulled this out, I was like, what are you doing with this? Like, man, I've just had it for forever. Like. They don't have it. But we had never had one before today. And then like two walked in. You just don't see it for sale. Super underappreciated. I feel like no one's really like going out of control trying to get it. Like, but to me, that's just like. When I've come across them, I've grabbed them. I also got two of large. I got four of them. Where are you getting them for? I paid. I think I paid two fifty for that one. I paid like one seventy five for the other one. I'll say they don't go for anything like. I found the crazy. one on Japanese auction. It took forever to find. I didn't see them flat out before then. Yeah. I'll pass on these just because the stains. All right. For this stuff right here, you'd be at like 17 store credit. 17. You guys be interested in the Scarface tees? Sure. If you like need to just make up like a little bit extra, I'll definitely work with you. You got a good piece there. You can even do like that. That's fine. Straight? Straight. Let's do it. 100% straight. 100%. One of the uh, the better pieces in this store, honestly. It's legendary. The 2XL is insane. Never seen a 2XL. Like, about that right there. Bro, I flew here for that. I'm dead. Yeah, dead ass. <laughs> oh, wait, where? I gotta it. come back. Yeah. yeah. I saw it on the post, like, yes, 100 people tagged me, and I was like, I gotta get it. Yeah. Damn, that's sick. Thank you, man. No Yo, problem. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Dude, I got a sixer of beers for my homies. Just kidding. Just a two pack. They're going to the web. We're going to the web. We are at a different location. We changed locations. But it's not open to the public, so don't go there. <laughs> but yeah, I'm about to show you it. I'll explain a little bit about what's going on with the website. That was a nice walk on first Friday here in Richmond. But yeah, here we are at New Web. Let's get on in. Alright, welcome. So we're just gonna show you how it is every day. Yeah. Uploading station. We got an old round two sign that was made for us by uh, by Bobby Carrington. Got the water hole right here. So 
where we talk about sports and politics. Usually a lot of sport talk, right, Biz? Yeah. My team? Patriots are my team. I can't believe the Seahawks didn't run the ball. <laughs> what the fuck? We got an outside over here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, show the viewers up. So this is a super old house, built in 1856. We got a photo studio over here. Bunch of old Supreme bandanas. We're gonna be focusing more on the rarer items. Bear bricks, random Supreme items. Uh, Budweiser shoes that were downstairs also. Um, got a stack of Cause Hype Beasts. This is a really cool Murakami postcard set. Really nice old stuff. Some older Supreme. We got the matching pants too. Some nice 85s. These beauties. 01. This is a really cool one too. You don't see it brand new all the time. These beauties. 17 year old shoe. Rumored to be coming out soon again. Bunch of dope stuff. A lot more dope stuff on the way. New York City. Round two. Let's get it. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Round two NYC. Almost six. Like 350. Two hours for this. It's worth it. Weather prepared now. I'm just excited to be here. Oh, look at fruitcake. What's up? Well, isn't that just a coinky dink? Yeah. Do you have a price you're looking for on it? Mint, I've seen them go for five. It has, it has minor blemishes. I'll show you where they are. I say mine should be like half of that, like 2,500. Gotta be careful, Graham. Fucking dickhole. Grabbing by his belly right now. It's like here and a sticker somewhere. Oh yeah, this yeah, big like right mark. Yeah. So yeah, I came up on that piece like um, on Newegg.com for like maybe like 480 bucks in 2013, and yeah, been holding on to it since. Um, I should be lower than that. I'd probably be around like 15 or so. It's just something that we use for display, honestly. We don't really sell them or anything. Okay, cool. you do that? Thank you, thank you. appreciate it. Oh, I'm definitely happy with the price. I actually came here just to trade in that to get some new camera equipment. Um, and my camera equipment was either 1500 or 25 and I got the 15 so I'm happy, for sure. Yeah, these are driving from Germany and they got the fucking kids team. You found this in Germany? Yep. Crazy, yo. Crazy. But that's not all. Beauty. But yeah, this kids tea, being that we're in New York and like, the fact that you got this in Germany, you brought it all the way over here, like that's what that's what I feel like we're for. Look, I mean, like I love it, dude. I love it so much. You trying to trade towards something, yeah. selling? Okay. The quickie shirt? That one's fire. I know, bro. <laughs> I guess I want to trade up for that, but I don't know. What okay, the and then if it, if it comes out to more, do you want cash on top, or do you just want to trade basically to get that? Basically, I just want to trade. Okay, cool. How much was that price at? A couple blimps. Uh, Elvis vintage tea and oh yeah the big like I guess it's a box over there yeah. um you want to do like this I'll do that yeah you can keep these there you go so my man over here brought in some some good trades and has taken home the only t-shirt that I wanted to buy out of the whole store sample quickie tea double print but he already knows his stuff because he's already wearing it my name is jack what's your name oscar oscar yeah. albert right yeah. do you guys live around here uh, we can well, yeah. part. Yeah. Uh, stuff. Uh, the part you don't want the part you don't want to be <laughs> my favorite description on the back yeah that's mood 24 7. all right it's the ice cube uh, album cover the predator album you been man how's everything I bought a couple pair of shoes, Dunkles, I got South Beaches and uh, Wheats. I wanted to get the cause for it, but uh, they sold them already, so I guess I'll take the cash. <laughs> you said you're looking for around like 12, 13 for everything. Yeah, right? I figured that's fair. I think I'd be pretty far off, honestly. Are you? Yeah, just because these never really sell that well for us. Like, where'd you value these at? Probably like 300. I think that's pretty fair. That's what I think I'm gonna like sell them for, like 350. I probably wanna sell these around three as well. Um, I wanna like maybe 250 for these. I think like 220 cash. Yes. If you want it. 250 store. What would you do cash for all three? Get 
you know, I'm a pretty, uh, pretty reasonable guy. You guys are good, so. These, I mean, you know how much these go for? What would you value those at? I think I want to put them in here like 450 ish. 450? Yeah. No. This easy go for a stack. You can't find the. Dunkles is one of the rarest SBs you can find. You can find everything else, but Dunkles, you can't find them anywhere, though. You can find beat up pairs. Even beat up pairs go for like five, six hundred. What do we have? I think we have a beat up pair over there for like 120. Like 120? Where is it at? I'll buy it right now. It's over there at the first. How beat up is it? Maybe I'll buy it. Yeah, I think, yeah. I think we might just be a little far off on fair this. off on this. Yeah. These guys, I give you, um, I give you like uh, like five for both if you want to. Sounds like a plan. Yeah. Couldn't sell the dunkles, but it's okay. You guys were blowing me up that t-shirt, the Salvador Dolly. Yeah. So like, yo, where did where do you get the Dolly shirt? Where do you get the Dolly shirt? Yeah. I'm like, I'm gonna launch it. In That's what everyone keeps asking me. They're like, yo, Salvador. Uh, it's called Saint Mateo. It's my first collection that I'm doing. So hope you guys like it. Uh, yeah. For now, it's gonna be online only. I miss Chris. You guys need to bring Chris back. He ain't meant for that. He ain't meant for Tim's and Snow. It's just not. It don't look good on him. What's up, my brother? How's everything, bro? Yo, my man, Stash on the wall, bro. That's legendary, yo. Stash. So what's the deal? Are y'all showing Jack's face or BK the gun, or y'all blurting it out? Uh, Have you decided? Well, the original idea was the uh, the smoke nose emoji, but I think me and Graham are just kind of running running with like you know whatever emoji kind of fits the situation. Like in this one right here, it's like the terrified one. Yeah. Bro, you guys gotta make it blurred out. Put like the, not the snitch voice, but the FBI oh, voice. Get this. That's the best contribution all day, pizza. People bring in shoes. Oh, Champion Pizza, 123 us run on the block. Fresh. It looks delicious. That's my shop, so I'll come to whenever you want. Thank you, man. Gio? Yeah. Good to meet Take you. Take it around. you're not busy, I'll look around. Alright. Oh, no, no. Get it. I get it. Same as slice. Same as slice. No, no, yeah, yeah. No, no pictures. The only thing I'm able to leak is the bottom of the sole if you want to take a picture of that. But. This is so dope, bro. Thanks, oh, yeah. Yeah, and they'll interchange. So you like Nike. Yeah, yeah. All the lore. Toe to heel. Dude, these are so fresh, bro. Thanks, yeah. Air Shans. PA to LA. Dude, I love this color, bro. It's a nice flow, bro. It's cool, you know? So next will be LA to New York. Yeah, dude, this is fucking amazing. Oh, wow. This is such a beautiful show. Show how we be. Yeah, that was a thing Nike did in the 80s. Yeah. Yo, the insta looks soft. Bro. It's super soft. Is it gonna be released like that? Yeah, all the lore. Dude. Yep. Yo, this is final <laughs> samples. This is exactly what you'll see this when it comes production. out in the store. Yeah, this production. Yeah. The textures are quality, bro. That's my thing is texture. It'll just it, they'll get so much character. Like, you see how it's fraying? And I, I, lo I love the lines. You know what I'm saying? Like, Different directions. Yeah. Like, it creates a lot. Yeah. Of that's what I'm thinking, yo. Round two will be closing in two minutes, and that's two minutes. Well, I switched my shirt that I was wearing, so Deshaun told me he would buy it from me, so I try to work that into a trade. I'm thinking about these. Got some other things on my mind. It's too much, man. Sensory overload. Yeah, from Brooklyn. It's great that you guys moved out here. Probably the vintage pieces, pieces because like in New York, there's not too much good thrifting. It's not like a suburban area or rural area. In New York, everybody just fucking pounces on it. Size 12, one size away. I was this close. I was this is exactly why we needed round two in New York. Culturally, this is what we needed. Thank you. How long have I been looking? It's everything that you're into, but it's like it makes sense on the price. Everywhere else in New York, everybody wants to give you like these outrageous prices that's not really, really worth it. Like if you're a sneakerhead, it doesn't matter if it's new, old, used, you just want the shoe. The prices are amazing and the store is amazing. Oh, this is my favorite piece. One of my new favorite pieces it says, fuck you. The <laughs> cost, the reversible bomber, the Louis duffel, the Supreme glasses, the Louis. Belts? 
I love it, man. I've been to everyone, Richmond. Got this shirt in the one in Richmond. Obviously, LA, New York. I mean, they're doing some good stuff, so, man, shout out to them. Yeah, this is a skier right there. And then, you know, I got I love the DigiT that came out this year. And this is the 98 store opening Tokyo one. That's one of my absolute favorites. That's the one. This is, this is so That's the cool. one. Because, like, I work at Polo, too. So, like, oh, I'm, really? Yeah, like, I walk in rocking all this shit. My boss, I'm like, oh, my God, we got to send a picture to corporate and shit. They're probably so hyped on it. Yeah, it's hell so yeah. Man. So, right here, I got some low sportswear lifestyle. Stripe. Normally you don't see it this thin. Whenever it comes with something like this, the corduroy, it's a lot heavier. And I missed out on this piece. The Scarface. Well, this yours jean jacket. So, you know, I might have to get both, man. I don't know. I mean, I'm happy there in New York. I'm happy there. Grand. What's up, Grand? Corduroy. You know, I'm waiting for this. You know, I'm ready for that. I was going to say this. Fresh, fresh wood. Ain't beat up yet. Nobody did a kick flip on this shit. <laughs> Nothing yet. <laughs> oh yeah. They look good with my outfit though. Nah, Shouts out to the vlog. Love it. Yeah. Been watching it since day one. Just got a pair of sneakers from round two. What did you do? Sade that I've been wanting forever. In gold, my favorite color. Got the USA Dream Team. Simple, but discreet. Another supreme piece. Appreciate round two, man. Coming from Hamden, Connecticut. Flight Vintage in Hamden, Connecticut. Check us out. Please bring all your final purchases to the nice lady at the front. Her name is Lucas Frazier. Having lunch, you know, enjoying the first Friday. You feel me out here in Richmond? I just saw my first pair of the off-white, the off-white um, blazers. You know what I mean? Best, best ones from the series. That's crazy. That's not even clothing. You got That's your transcended right clothing. It's power phases right here. 150. Not bad. One line over here trying to kill people for 250, but 150 is a nice price. Got the shadow ones, man. Size 13. This is my lucky day for real, for real. Cream hoodie. Come from Hampton, Virginia. It's anorak. Shit's hard. <laughs> 300, but I had like 90 store credit, so. To come up. So we're back. Another season, it's live. We made some improvements here in the shop. We got heat for days. <laughs> yeah, 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 See, you know, what a hectic Saturday is like. Uh, oh yeah, we definitely gotta do the night picture. We got some goodies uh, to put out. Definitely a lot of heat. Woo! Woo! That's a wrap. Uh, my first day, expecting, I knew it was busy, but I didn't think it was that busy. And then the pop-up thing, that was just ridiculous. The flow, I didn't even know that there was this much, like, actual, yeah, like, there's a lot of work, but there's also like a concrete like flow of how things work in round two, and I had no idea that's how it was, you know, whether you're working at the wall, or like the register, or like back there buying, or even just like putting stuff, to, it's, there's just a lot to do, and I just didn't know that there was that much to do. So it was pretty dope, it was pretty cool. I had a good time. Easy, sit Damn, way to fucking damage the product, you dumb ass. And we're out. Day one, that's a fucking wrap. Ow. <laughs> you gotta pay attention. Welcome to the Graham Nation, where Graham controls everything that you see and hear. Uh, yeah, so this year, round two, we're actually doing a semen collab. He's going to be our donor. We're going to do a full collage of the entire staff. <laughs> Send your inspo <laughs> at Rat Pack Lucas. <laughs> Let's do some raffles tomorrow. Raffle it off! We're raffling these off. New used. used. <laughs> a couple times. New and used. Nine out of ten. Chris Russo. He made me clean them yesterday. They had little stains. 